This is the computer after upgrading from Windows 10 to Windows 11. As you can see it has unsupported hardware. No TPM 2.0. I upgraded the OS without a flash drive. It took about one hour to complete so you should be patient at some steps. It runs Windows 11. Version 25H2. Follow these steps to upgrade to Windows 11 on a computer with unsupported hardware. This is the computer before the operating system upgrade. I use the Windows 11 hardware compatibility checker. The result shows that it does not have supported hardware. It is running Windows 10. Windows 10 is no longer used. So I need to find a way to upgrade to Windows 11. I went to the Microsoft homepage to download the latest Windows 11 installer. Download Windows 11. Download Windows 11 disk image for x64 device. Windows 11 multi edition for x64 device. Select the product language. Download Windows 11 English. Next install the Windows 10 installer. You need both Windows 10 and Windows 11 installers. I will explain later why you need to use the Windows 10 installer. Create Windows 10 installation media. ISO file. I download the Windows 10 installation image file. Browse to the location where the installation file is stored. Here are the two files that were downloaded from the Windows website. Here is the Windows 10 installation file. I renamed it for easy identification. Why use these two files? I use the Windows 10 installation file to upgrade to Windows 11 so I need a tool to edit these files. This tool is called AnyBurn. You download and install the software. Just the free version. Let's get started. Here is the Windows 11 installation file. You double click on the file. Open. Here are all the files in the Windows 11 installation file. You find the largest file in the folder called source. The file you are looking for is called install WIM. You copy it to your desktop. It will be used in the next steps. Here is the file I have extracted it from the Windows 11 installer. I will add it to the Windows 10 installer. The Windows 10 installer helps me upgrade this computer to Windows 11. That is my goal. I use AnyBurn to customize the Windows 10 installer. Edit image file. Browse to the Windows 10 installer. List of files in the installer. Find a file in the folder called source. In this folder you find a file called install ESD. Delete the file called install ESD. The goal is to replace it with the file called install WIM from the Windows 11 installer. Add the file called install WIM from the home screen to the folder called source of the Windows 10 installer. File added successfully. Create a new custom Windows 11 installer. Name it as you like. Browse to the home screen where I saved the new installer. The custom installer is complete done. Now I just need to use it to upgrade the operating system. Double click on the newly created file. Double click on the executable file. Change how Windows setup downloads updates. Not right now. Next. Accept. This step takes a long time so be patient. Install Windows 11 Pro. 
Hardware check completed. The computer will be upgraded to Windows 11. Even though it doesn't have supported hardware. This is how I upgraded my computer from Windows 10 to Windows 11, even though it has unsupported hardware. Thanks for watching. Good luck.